Cut it out. It's worse than gnolls out there. Nothing we need to worry about. How about a dragon? Would that worry you? I'd give it a bloody good fight, that's for sure. Huh. Anything you give it. shelter here, but we've grave injuries to tend to. Who or what attacked you? A devil. The most deadly foe we've yet encountered. We are paladins of Tyr, Lord of Justice. He sent us after an infernal being, straight out of the Nine Hells, hiding in the form of a one-horned tiefling. One horn? Then you mean Karlak. Archdevil's bootlicker. You know her, which means you know what the fiend is capable of. She slaughtered countless refugees fleeing the Absolute. Yesterday, she butchered an entire family without mercy. Wait, fleeing the Absolute? We were lucky to survive our encounter with her. At a fell of religion! Where's the devil? She ran toward the river when she saw we were merely wounded, not dead. Down the hill from here. She must pay for her crimes. If you capture her, you will have served here where we could not. This is the sword of justice, blessed by Tear. I've wielded it since I swore my oath. It's all I have, but it's yours if you stop her. Bring me her head. And Tyr will consider her crimes repaid. Very well. May the just God guide you. regards you lifelessly.
good save now. Since I see uh, the tiefling. One horn, the stink of Avernus, Advocatus Diaboli. <sighs> well, I'll be God's damned. The Blade of Frontiers. I thought I'd shaken you for good. That'll teach me to underestimate you. You're the devil we've been... Damn, that's a... What a bit. Bloody right. An honor to be chased by the Blade of Frontiers. But I... Ugh! A great heat roars through you. Her heat. Lost in visions of demonic armies as you tear through a landscape of fire and blood, the Blood Horn. You saw it from above as the Nautiloid passed through Avernus. This woman was on the front line. What was that? Evidence. Proof that you're a devil. A gladiator in the Archdevil Zariel's army. I can explain, but it's a whole situation. If you just hear me out... Another vision. Karlak's blade raised, slicing through devils, Zariel's servants, as her eyes dart around, seeking escape. Her rage and desperation seep into you. She is a victim of the Blood War, not an agent of it. She's trying to trick us. Don't believe her lies. You saw the truth. I never wanted to serve Zariel. I was enlisted in her army against my will. Forced to fight, and fight I did. When I saw an opportunity to get away, I took it. Finally home. Near it anyway. You served her. That's enough to damn you. Stand down, Will. You saw what I saw. Will catches his breath and his lips straighten. Sheer dread twists his face. You don't know what you're saying. You're asking me to trust a devil. God, you're stubborn. God's not a devil and you know it. You saw her thought. She poses no danger to the Sword Coast. You know monsters, right? Better than anyone. Look into my eyes. Can't you see I'm not what you think? Shit. You really are no devil, are you? I've... I've been deceived. Oh, thank the gods. Thought I was gonna have to take your head. <laughs> you would have died in the attempt. But there have been enough threats today. Truce then, eh? Aye. Truce. I'm Karlak. But you already knew that. And you are... Talafia! Well met, soldier. Nice to meet a friendly around here. It's been tough going so far. I may not be a devil, but I can put the Blade's reputation to work. How would you feel about helping me kill some evil bastards? Oh. Little background, if your moral compass needs something to point at. You already know I fought in the Blood War. I was good. Really good. It turns out I've got a knack for killing demons. That made me a valuable asset. Zariel, the archdevil herself, made me as her personal attack dog. I played along until I could get the fuck out of there, but devils don't like to lose their assets. <laughs> Zariel liked it so little. She sent a bunch of goons, so-called paladins of tear, to take me back. Problem is, I'm not going. Don't worry, I'll lead the charge. But I could use your help. 
There's a lot of them and only one of me. After that, we can team up. Take Faerun by the short hairs. Sound good? Let's do it. Fuck yes! They cornered me outside the toll house just up the hill. Doubt they've gone far after the scorching I gave them. Ah, uh, hang on though. Looks like you've got enough backup at your side. Not sure there's room for me. I'll catch up with you when it's time to camp for now. But don't get to any of the fun stuff without me. Got it? You've been witness to a pantomime, I'm sorry to say. And I've played my part all too poorly. What's that supposed to mean? Someone saying you'd catch a tail. I'd like to know who this source of yours is. I can say only this. Karlak's not the only one who's had a villain's knife held to their throats. One night soon when we make camp, the veil will be lifted, and I'll pay my penance. Penance? Should I be worried? You're not in any danger, I promise. I can't say the same about me. Try again, keep clothes on. Trust me, I'll tell you all about it after we take care of the goons on my tail. As I said, never have any gun in the background. <laughs> What's so funny? You haven't got some laughing curse, have you? <laughs> I really made it out of Avernus. It's incredible. All right, just keep it down. We're conspicuous enough without your. Hyena call. Survive another assault. Leave us in peace, and we shall leave you in kind. Cut the crap, Anders. I know what you are. Don't let her hurt us. Please. We just want to go home. suspect 
he's lying. Enough of the charades. I know who you really are. Enough! Enough! I'll not play pretend anymore. Karlak, you're going home in pieces if needs must. And you, you'll soon learn what it means to ally yourself with the likes of this garbage. Avernus was never my home. It was my prison. I'm free now. And I'm never going back! The Ranger? Oh, you pay for that bitch. You pay with your life. Image, no, where is she going?
Slow down. Oh, she's coming back down. Destroying everything.
disregards you lifelessly. Platinum coin. All right. Felt good letting off a little steam after facing off with those ignots. Granted, the fire lasted a little longer than it should. Could you withstand the heat? I like to look up. Careful, soldier. If I burn any hotter, I might explode. Hear that? Infernal engine for a heart. Let's me burn as hot as the hells. Seems to be running in overdrive since I left Avernus. Won't be seeing my mechanic anytime soon, so I'll just make the most of the extra heat. Just don't get too close till I've found a way to calm it down. How does that. How the hell did you get an infernal engine for on heart? High pain tolerance and a dynamic duo of truly shitty bosses. But it 
it's a bit early in the game to be getting into tragic backstories. Let's save the Scar show for later, after we've worked up an appetite for tragedy. Meanwhile, I'll need to find someone who can tune up my engine sooner rather than later. Believe me when I say this thing is hot. The first time I faced down those paladins, they let slip there was an infernal mechanic in the area. A tiefling. He might be able to stabilize things, if I can find him. They meant Damon, tiefling weaponsmith. A weaponsmith, huh? Not sure if he's the guy, but I'd love to find out. A tune-up would do this rusty heart a world of good. you lifelessly. Who are you? Toll collector, Martin. How did you do that? Laughing. Cut in. Hmm. Goblins in the area. Why were you in the basement? Hiding. Frightened. Were you alone when you died? Gods abandoned me. Advance. He died. Uh oh. Perception. I DM's enough to know that's a bad thing. What can I do you for? Sell it? Well, I can't sell it, but if I can make stuff from it, send it back.
Whew. I'm gonna make a lot of money. Oh no, I don't oh fuck. Get out of it.
place is trapped. Just a critical success. Be wary. This place is trapped. Looks empty. to you. What's the story? With Bellamori? Don't know. Don't think that was ever discovered. on it. Just another crate. Be wary. This place Some is trapped. Like visitors. I need... Guidance.
no point in looking at these because I already know it's empty. But anyway. Is that any oh, good I could to you? go for a good meal. Tell me what this is. Don't be shy. Still breathing, despite everything. Despite everything. Okay, send us stuff. Oh, wow, wow. I'm just looking for a waypoint. A waypoint discovered. Nice. Where is it? Bodies everywhere. Accident? What's that? Sabotage. Where's this waypoint? It's right there. Oh, Let's see about selling some of this crap I got. Open the gates. Let's go talk to Aaron. Bum bum bum. Bum bum bum. Bum bum bum. Anything else? Yes, uh, I'll like to see. Of course, West. but please remember, you're not the only one in need. Okay, you got seven hundred and seven gold. Got it. Actually, you know, if I keep these on me and just sell this stuff first.
camp. Sylvanas be with you. Yes, Sylvanas be with you too. Uh, Moving Maliki in. Bella. No helping it. We're exposed now. Easy money. Yeah, right. Damn, I could use the target practice. Use his wooden tools. Tell me, my guy. Thought I sensed an inferno around here. But you aren't from Eldorel. What's your story? I spent a good bit of time in the hells. Enlisted against my will by the Archdevil Zariel. Same as you, I suppose, if you're from Eldorel. The devils were delighted when your city was swallowed up. I thought they had you for keeps. Glad you got out. I got lucky. It looks like you did too. And you brought some infernal machinery with you. A little gift from Zariel. Keeps me burning hot. Very hot by the smell of it. Might be burning out a piston ring or leaking oil. Mind if I take a listen? Be my guest. But don't get too close, or your eyes will melt shut. You! You really are burning up. Whoever put that engine together tried to house metallurgized Demano valves inside a Ragnax alloy casement. Very risky. I might be able to help. I'd need infernal iron. And a prayer that my hammer will survive the work. That thing isn't meant to operate outside of Ernest. I'm not sure how much longer it'll keep running the way it's going. Will you be able to turn down the temperature a little? Worried I'm gonna go in for a handshake and singe someone's arm off one of these days. I'd worry about surviving the night first. But help one, help both. If we can cool you off, it'll stabilize your engine and allow you to touch whomever you please. Where should we look for eternal iron? I've sensed some during our travels. It has a, a pull to it. Absolutely magnetic, once you know what you're looking for. I can show you where I'd look. Meanwhile, I've still got plenty of weapons and armor in stock if you're looking to load up. Shows off his thunder wave. Depends. How many people are dumb enough to ask? <laughs> True. Uh -huh. What's this? I take it.
forged from the heart. Got some iron heart, so I'll be back. Alright. Listen, Gail. Gail. I tried to give you stuff. Ah. Glad you've a moment for me. My, um. predicament has become rather urgent. I need a magical artifact to consume. Right now. We've already found enough magic to soothe its disquiet. If you'll just give me what I need. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I keep trying. Look, donate. And then what? Thank you. Oh. It's like a lullaby that sings to sleep the demon inside. A metaphorical demon, I haste to point out, but no less dangerous. And no less bound to wake up again to continue its ravages. Such is the nature of all monsters. In fact, you're feeling better. Your condition sounds unpleasant, to say the least. That was not so bad once you get used to it. And, on the plus side, my tower in Waterdeep has never been so free of clutter. Hmm. Sincerely, though, I understand I ask a lot from you with few answers in return. But in time, all will be told. Don't mention, I'm glad I could help. My lady, I bow to your boundless kindness. Bet you never thought a drug could be so kind. What's on your mind? Your enterprising approach to my problem is most encouraging. But it is a delicate process to keep my condition stable. I do not yet need to consume an item, but keep it close by. It will not be too much longer. Yeah, not really. Join me, why don't you? There's plenty of adventure to be had. With pleasure. Lead on. So just press escape. That's what you need to do. Alright. How fares the search? I found some inferno iron you mentioned. Please let this work. Mmm. The weight of it. And that blaze of chaos. Can't imagine this where my heart should be. Must be quite the experience. Give me just a moment. I think... There. You'll have to install it, I'm afraid. I don't think there are thick enough gloves in all the realms to protect from that kind. Still burning hot as hell's hole, but I feel less changeable. Cheers, mate. Pleasure. And as for the heat, I haven't got any solutions now, but I'm not giving up. Could be if the combustion chamber had its own insulation, or if we had some kind of enchanted coolant. Find me again in Baldur's Gate. If I'm worth my salt, I'll have figured something out by then. Take care, Karlak. And hopefully the next time I see you, I'll have something promising to report. Pocket any 
infernal iron you find along the way. Hmm? Wow, well good. Damn druids. Who uses rotten tools? Damon's upgrade didn't cool me down, but it did juice me up. I don't think I've ever felt more powerful. Let's find some evil for you to smack then. Bring it on. Die if I met Moroic and reeking of this place. Yeah. I'll never get the smell out of my clothes. <laughs> <laughs> 